but you can see there, these haven't moved at all. Oh my God in heaven. What is good everybody, today we are going on another WWE action figure toy hunt and hopefully we can find some new stuff to add to the collection. Of course, we are on the hunt right now for Walmart figures. Why is the damn camera shaking so much, Brad? I've always calmed down. But I know Ultimate Edition Monday Night War Series 3 is hitting. I think it's Series 3. Is it Series 2? Eddie Guerrero and Mankind? What's the other figures? Is it just Roddy Piper and Bret Hart? Maybe it's just Series 2? Elite Series 3 is hitting. That's what it is. Okay, that makes more sense. So that's currently what we're looking for. Of course, we're, we're on the hunt for those things. So you can join me on my adventure today as we try and find these things. Going to be hitting Walmart. Going to be hitting Target. And you guys know that my Target has been the worst shish I've ever seen. We're still going to go there anyway, see if they can find some good stuff there. But I'm not going to hold my breath, man. I'll, I'll, be, I'll be passed away in no time. Nonetheless, any new figures are always a hit. We found Elite 109 last time. We're going to go to that same Walmart. Maybe they'll have some new stuff. But... You never know, man. Just join us on the hunt as we adventure out, and I will see you guys at the first store, and I believe it's going to be Walmart. Location number one is Walmart. I don't expect shish, man. Looking for those Ultimate Edition Monday Night Wars figures and possibly some Elites. We'll see. The Elite game's been dry, my Walmarts, man. Let's find out. All right, guys, here we go. Let's see what we got. Chilling in Walmart today, man. All right, we got a little decent... Oh, a little Kurt Angle action right there. I don't think I've ever seen this at retail. So we found Kurt Angle at retail. That's pretty nice. Never saw this at retail, I don't think. I think this is my first time ever. Still hate that torso. Hope we get another Kurt Angle revealed at San Diego Comic-Con, but first time ever seeing that. We got four of the Maya Villa Legacy Packs. Those are nice. I wish these would go in clearance. These go in clearance, I'm gonna clear them out. We have Hulk Hogan, but it's the first version. What the hell? We got the first version, which was in the series with The Fiend, right? Am I tripping? How would this be here? And this is, there's Charlotte. So isn't this supposed to be repainted? It's the greatest hits though. What the hell? Is this a return? Did somebody return this? It looks to be factory sealed. Okay, well that's weird. So we have the greatest hits Hulk Hogan, but it's not repainted. I'm gonna have to ask somebody about that. That's crazy, I've never seen that before. You can see it says greatest hits, but it's the original, but it's sealed up. So I don't I don't think it's a return. So I don't know, that's that's an interesting find right there. Do we have Charlotte, like we stated, we have Charlotte Flair right here. Dude, the radio in here is freaking loud as hell. The greatest hits, Charlotte right there. And then we saw Bianca last time. So they have Bianca here and it looks like, yeah, we have another Bianca right here. So we have two Biancas, same figure, still haven't reviewed it, way behind, hate to see it. We have the Austin Theory and John Cena battle pack. Picked this up one time on a toy hunt. Got some superstars, we have Doink, Roddy, Hulk, Doink, 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 Jesus Christ. We have another Doink, Andre the Giant, Hulk Hogan, Chase, Bam Bam, and Roddy Piper. And we have Andre the Giant again. We have Hulk Hogan, Chase. All these are the same. I guess my area just doesn't really collect superstars figures because there's like 17 of these Chase Hogans. Wow, there we have another one. Is this the Chase or is it the regular edition? It is the Chase again, so. We're just stacking up chases. And then we have another doink down here. My God in heaven, man. So many of the same figures. And then for AEW, we do have Statlander, Statlander, Eddie Kingston, Eddie Kingston, Eddie Kingston, Thunder Rosa back there, always chilling. Eddie Kingston, ton of Eddie Kingston's Matt, Matt, and Matt. And then up there, we have more Eddie Kingston. Bless his heart. Kurt Angle, can't believe it. That's the weirdest thing I've ever seen, man. But over here, we do have, oh, we have Jey Uso and Roman Reigns Battle Pack in the promo gear. I thought this would be Elite 110, man. I thought this would be Elite 110. I thought this would be the exact figure with the shoes and all. They said, nah, F that. But we do have the new Universal Championship or the Undisputed Championship. We've got Jey Uso in there. We have Rim Serum Gunther, seen that a couple times. And then another Theory and uh, Cena. I don't know why I want to say Theory and Austin. You know what I meant? We have Katana Chance, Shayna Baszler, Seth, Seth, AJ Styles, Tamina. More Seths, more AJs, Bianca, and then more of the same basic wave shish ton of rumblers man or rumble rings is that what it's called rebound ring i keep wanting to call it a rumble ring but you can see there these haven't moved at all oh my god in heaven new knuckle crunchers man we have new knuckle crunchers we have bobby lashley haven't seen this cody stone cold sheamus and bobby lashley do they have the rest of them oh snap man hold up now hold up now so they do have the american nightmare cody Rhodes right here hell yeah so they have bobby they have cody they have sheamus they do have Seamus right here. So there's the third one in the set. And it looks like they have one Stone Cold Steve Austin as I drop John Cena. Oh, dude, we're buying these. I'm getting all four of them. I can't believe it. We're getting all four of those. Hell yeah, dude. Didn't expect to come here and find Knuckle Crunchers. 
I saw somebody finding a lot of them, but I had not found them yet. So this is my first time seeing Series 2 in the wild. I was just talking about these, and now I have found them. Let's go, man. Stone Cold Steve Austin, Sheamus, Cody Rhodes, and Bobby Lashley. That's freaking amazing. I love it. So happy to find these, man. I can't believe I'm actually giddy about finding knuckle crunchers. What world are we living in? All right, man, so I got to make some decisions. We have the Knuckle Cruncher Series 2, and then we have the Battle Pack with Roman and Jay. I don't know if I want to grab this. I'm definitely not skipping. I, I'm skipping Kurt. I have like three or four of those. Don't need Kurt Angle. But in terms of everything else, I still find this weird. That is just such an interesting thing. I can't believe, like, did some of the greatest hits make it out that didn't have the tan upgrade, I guess? I don't I don't know. That's a very weird thing. And again, it is sealed up for the eighth time. But I'm going to have to make some selections here, but I think we are done at this Walmart location. Not bad at all. I didn't expect to find the knuckle crunchers, so we're going to chalk that up as a W, and we're going to move on to the next location. I'm in location number two, Super Target. They don't ever have shish nowadays, but let's see if we can flip the script right here. Find out when we go in the aisle. I don't even know why we come to Target, man. Yep, just as I expected. Look at this trash. Six Hogan's. And any chases? Any chases? Uh, no, no chases. So seven Hogan's. They are marked off, but the Sultan fell over here. Okay, so Captain Lou is $11.49, but I don't see any right here. Maybe they're in a different spot, but completely bare bones, man. Just complete trash over here. In the Marvel Legends section, we do have Falcon or a new Captain America. Pretty cool to see in the wild. And then we have the new Iron Man Wave. Pretty cool, actually. I don't think I've seen any of these in person. Marvel Legends has been slacking lately, so you guys know that this is actually a W right here. She-Hulk, Iron Man. Nice, man. They have the full wave, I think. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Pretty dope, man. Never seen these in person, so those cards are amazing with the purple and pink. Look really good. Nice She-Hulk. Don't need it, but still cool to see. This has been here forever. Oh, and we have the new movie Deadpool figure. Pretty cool, man. I'm just happy to see new things. Happy to see new things. Don't care really what it is, but seems like Marvel got new stuff, but wrestling is slacking. I'm going to go ahead and put this back on the pegs right there. There you go. I'll just leave that right there. And then here's Captain Lou. 11 bucks. 11.50. Don't need it, but at least it's on clearance, I guess you could say. But it's early Saturday morning, nobody in here, so it's good. Usually, Target's kind of stressful with shopping because it's usually busy, but it's before it's busy. But wrestling, trash. Let's go over to the NECA section. All right, man, here in the NECA section, look at all this crap. It's crazy. I mean, I'm not saying it's all crap, but there's a lot of crap here. Look at all the different titles and figures and amount of plastic we got over here. Thanksgiving right here. Ultimate John Carver. I don't think I've ever seen that in person. That's pretty cool. We got a lot more stuff too. I don't think I've seen the monsters here. It may have been there last time. Anyway, Joker Mobile again. And that is, I don't see anything I need. So I'm out. <sighs> All right, man. Back home after the toy hunt. We got some good shish. Hey, that's when I met Cody Rhodes at WrestleMania. What a handsome man. And Cody Rhodes. The first figure is going to be Sheamus right here. He comes with a breakaway ladder. I'm pretty I'm pretty interested in this. We are going to review this entire wave on the channel, but we do have Sheamus here throwing Bobbeth Lashley. Got the rest of the stuff. I still haven't unboxed the rebound ring, and I guess nobody else is unboxing that damn thing either because everybody and their mom has 27 on the shelves. But this is possibly my favorite figure in the set as being a big Stone Cold Steve Austin mark and also being a big Cody Rhodes guy. This is the wave for me. We got Cody and we have Stone Cold, but... This is what I always loved as a kid. I always wanted Austin in shorts like this. So to have this in a knuckle cruncher is always a bonus. But he comes with a steel chair. We also have Bobbeth Lashley here. And he is in the red gear. We got a top talents figure. Very similar to this. But he comes with a large barbell, which is cool. He's beating up Sheamus. Returning the favor there. Crunch the competition. Don't know how I feel about that one. Then we have the America Nightmare himself. They did put the appropriate tag on there. I'm just... Yeah, the real ones know. But one thing that's interesting about this Cody Rhodes is... They have the damn tattoo in the right spot. Take some damn notes. Take some damn notes, Mattel. Look at this right here. Or I say Mattel like Mattel didn't create this. Mattel created this, but look, this is how it should look on the elites and the ultimates, man. Look at Cody Rhodes right here, man. Look what you could be. Look at him. Answer me. 
But I like this figure a lot. I think it's pretty cool. We are going to review these, but this is all I grabbed on the toy hunt. But I can show off some other things that we picked up. But I was happy to find these. I didn't expect to find Knuckle Crunchers in the wild. Apparently, Series 3 is hitting as well, which includes Rey Mysterio, Dominic Mysterio, another John Cena in the red gear, and then AJ Styles, which also looks like a cool wave. But I'm excited, man. I like, I like these figures a lot. So we're going to unbox these. We're going to review this full set. And I need to come up with some cool display to put in the room to showcase all these figures. But let's show off some other shish. Now, this other shish in the background right here, I got some insulation foam board, which isn't the most exciting, but I have plans for this. I have plans for all this stuff that we have over here. I'm building something, all right? I'm building something. I'm working on something. And I have something else coming in the mail later that is going to go hand in hand with this. It's a bunch of crowd members. That's a, that's a shish ton of crowd. So this Roman Reigns, and the reason that, I know I've already showed this off, but the reason I put this up here is because I'm going to have 10 of these available for sale that I think I'm going to put on my next Whatnot stream, and they're going to be available in the Buy It Now, so you'll just be able to go over there and purchase them, so be on the lookout for that. They're going to be painted very similar to this. It will have the fade in there. It'll be the Elite 110 head sculpt and everything, so you can buy the head sculpt. It'll have the fade and everything, and it will not be like the you know the mattel counterpart it will be completely repainted you know with everything going on there and you will have that for your roman reigns collection you can buy it you can put it on any of your other roman reigns figures or you can you know replace your elite 110 head sculpt with whatever but i did buy a lot of the roman reigns elite 110 and i will be selling off those head sculpts so if that's something that interests you stay tuned next whatnot stream i don't know the exact date of it just yet but we will have those Roman Reign head sculpts available on there, as well as custom belts and, you know, more shish for the whatnot stream. So you can, you know, stay tuned for that. But I did want to talk about that before we get the hell out of here. But outside of our knuckle crunchers, man, I think that about wraps up our toy hunt. Thought about getting Kurt Angle, decided against it, didn't want to grab it. I just, I already have a couple of those, so I didn't think I needed it. And I think we're going to get a better version of that revealed at San Diego Comic-Con. I think we're going to get a brand new Kurt Angle. So I'm going to hold my breath on that one. Oh yeah, I forgot to showcase this. We have The Rock, or maybe I put this in a video already. I can't remember, but there's the Amazon re-release Greatest Hits version. But that is pretty much going to wrap up the toy hunt, man. I hope you guys did enjoy. I'd like to know down in the comment section below what your area is looking like. You know, I still can't find Monday Night War Series 2 or 3. Haven't found the Ultimate Editions. I want to review all of that here on the channel and grab those for the collection. So it is a work in progress. We're working on it. But a huge shout out to our Patreon members, man. Appreciate all those fellas, man. Thank you guys so very much for your continued support. As always, man, you guys are absolutely goaded. I appreciate every single one of you guys every single day. But that is pretty much going to wrap the toy hunt, man. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy. Leave me your thoughts down below. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at MyDamnToys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a blessed one, and I'll catch you later.